Hey, what's up, you guys? It's Caboose bringing you another Spider-Man No Way Home video. And today, what I got for you guys here is the rumor about when the next trailer for Spider-Man No Way Home is going to drop, as well as my personal opinion about if Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield, who we suspect is going to be in the movie, should show up in this next trailer. Before we get into everything, wanted to ask you guys, of course, if at any point you enjoy the video, if you could consider leaving a like rating on it, it would show your support, and I would really appreciate it. So if you enjoy the video at any point, especially if you're hyped for Spider-Man No Way Home, then that would be awesome. If you're new here and you want to keep up to date on this film, I got you covered. I'm making videos on all the news and updates, reacting to that next trailer whenever we get it, and so much more. If that sounds good to you, hit that subscribe button and the notification bell to be immediately notified when a video goes live. Lastly, wanted to remind you guys that I am sponsored by G Fuel. Grab yourself some tubs, some shaker cups, some cans, some starter kits, or the Venom Let There Be Carnage G Fuel, which is available now. Now, just make sure if you grab anything that you use code caboose to check out and support your boy and with all that being said let's get into this okay so we all have been wondering about when we're going to be getting a second trailer i mean that first trailer literally broke the internet it became the most viewed trailer in 24 hours of all time so clearly people are excited and want to see more from this movie and while daniel rpk who's a pretty reliable source may have the info about when we can expect to see that next trailer i will say take it with a grain of salt although it's pretty safe to assume that he's right here especially considering the fact that we know we're gonna get a second trailer at least between now and december 17th when the movie drops but take everything with a grain of salt regardless as he has had some misses when it comes to inside info he's reported but when it comes to sony marvel films for the most part he's been right he reports here on his second account on twitter that he hears we'll be getting the second hashtag spider-man no way home trailer in november again a fairly safe assumption you don't really need inside info to make an educated guess like this but to go off of that why i think for sure it's going to be in november is because of a special day taking place on november 12th known as disney plus day now disney plus day is something being held of course by disney in which they're going to showcase a ton of upcoming projects for disney plus and then Marvel is specifically going to have a showcase on things that are upcoming for the MCU. From what I understand, that includes both, I imagine, things that they're going to drop on Disney+, Plus, and as well, things that are going to be theatrical. Now, will this be the moment that they drop the trailer for Spider-Man No Way Home? I don't think so, as when it comes to marketing, I believe it's mostly Sony who handles it, but there's a fairly good chance that Sony might drop that second trailer for Spider-Man No Way Home a little bit after Disney Plus Day. And the reason why I say a little bit after is because because while Marvel is going to announce a ton of new projects, right? There's going to be so much hype regarding the MCU and all the things that are coming up. And it would be smart for Sony to piggyback off that Marvel hype by dropping a second trailer for Spider-Man No Way Home and just increasing the hype tenfold. I mean, no matter what, when that second trailer drops, the hype is going to be real and the internet's going to light on fire again. However, if they're going to piggyback off that hype of the MCU announcements, it would just be smart marketing. Now the question becomes though, do they show? Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield in this second trailer do they spoil that reveal or I should say quote unquote spoil we're gonna talk about why I think they should and why I think they shouldn't okay reasons why they should and this is sort of the side that I am leaning to but let's talk about it I think that they should do this because we're in some pretty rough circumstances here. The film industry has certainly taken a hit and we're looking for any win we can get here at the box office. Having Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield show up in a second trailer for Spider-Man No Way Home would generate hype like you cannot even believe. And while there are already so many people who are going to try and get out of the house and see this movie, they want as many people in theaters as possible when December 17th hits. So yes, some people People might not like it if they end up revealing Toby and Andrew in another trailer, but it would make sense considering the fact that they are just trying to make as much money off this movie as possible, considering the circumstances around the world, which I feel is fair. Another reason why I think it would be okay if they showed them in this trailer is because, I mean, come on, we've suspected this for a while now. It's been in the rumor mill and the talk of the town for the last couple of months that Toby and Andrew are going to be in this movie, so I think it be okay if they were to market it and say hey yes we don't need to keep it a secret anymore toby Maguire and andrew garfield are coming back in spider-man no way home 
home. Now just get excited to see what they're going to do alongside Tom Holland Spider-Man come December. I don't think I'm going to lose too much sleep if they end up showing them in the trailer. It's just going to get me more excited to see the movie. I mean, hearing Tobey Maguire or Andrew Garfield just say anything and interact with Tom Holland Spider-Man, it's going to have me giddy. But reasons why they shouldn't. Let's talk about that too, okay? So I think the first reason and one of the biggest reasons why they shouldn't show Tobey Maguire or Andrew Garfield in this second trailer is because, well, as I mentioned, that first trailer broke the internet and that was without Toby or Andrew being in it. I mean, just going off of the reveal of Alfred Molina being in the film as Doc Ock and returning from Spider-Man 2, as well as presumably Willem Dafoe coming back as Green Goblin, Jamie Foxx as Electro, that stuff alone has generated enough hype to have it be the most viewed trailer of all time ahead of Avengers Endgame in a 24-hour time span. So yeah, suffice to say, people are going to go see the movie. And the other reason why maybe they shouldn't show Toby or Andrew is because while I say it's kind of the worst kept secret and a ton of people are talking about it and it's been in the rumor mill forever, there are a lot of people, general audience members, who only know and are going off of what was seen in that first trailer. They have no idea what's happening on the internet. They have no idea what people are talking about when it comes to the rumors for this film. All they know is what they have seen officially revealed. And that's going to be the case with the second trailer as well. So do they want to keep that secret for those general audience members who have no idea what's going on and just want to go see the film and end up being surprised by the fact that Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield are in it? I think it's a pretty fair argument, but once again, when it comes to my personal opinion, I lean more towards the side of them just showing it anyways getting that secret out of the way we need to stop pretending they're not in the movie and then just get excited for them being in the movie it's an interesting argument to be had on either side and now i want to kick it to you guys please let me know your thoughts in the comments below do you think that they should show the other two spider-man in this next trailer or you think they should hold off and save that reveal for the release of the film sound off in the comments and of course if you enjoyed today's video if you could consider leaving a like rating on it it would show your support and i would really appreciate it i'm caboose and you can click on screen to make your way to one of the other videos on the channel or you can click my logo to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already you can also follow me on instagram and twitter those links are going to be in the description drop a like if you enjoyed leave a comment if you have an opinion and subscribe if you're new see you guys later